everyone, I'm Larissa, brand educator for 100% Pure, and today I'm going to go over a makeup routine that I like to do. Um, it mainly consists of like a daily makeup routine, but today I'm throwing in a fancy red lip to go with my hair. I'm going out for an event tonight, so um, I just thought I'd jazz it up a little bit with a bright lip. And introduce your dog. <laughs> this is my BFF4L. His name is Ziggy, and he's a very good boy. And he's here today to help me with my makeup. How old is he? Ziggy is three. Oh, how did you get him? Um, we adopted him from a lady who couldn't keep him. So um, we just found out she couldn't keep him. So we said that we would take him in and he's been the best thing that ever happened to us. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah. <laughs> Licking the table. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's All right. get started. Okay, so um, the first thing I'm going to apply is going to be my SPF um, tomato lycopene. It's really important for everyone to put SPF on daily. It helps protect you from aging and even the lights indoors can, you know, cause the signs of aging, mm -hmm. so. Got it in my nose. <laughs> <laughs> so the next thing I'm going to do, I'm gonna apply a primer. This helps keep your makeup on your face. This one has resveratrol in it, so that's a super potent antioxidant. Mm -hmm. Helps keep the skin youthful. So I did like two pumps. Some, if you feel like you need more, you, you mm -hmm. can always do more. Just kind of apply it all over the face where my makeup's gonna go. Okay, the next product I'm gonna use is one of my favorites. It is our BB cream. I'm using um, number 10, Luminous. I'm using Starbright eyeshadow, and because I'm doing the bold lip, I'm going really light on the eye. I don't want too much going on up there, so. I like to like softly bring it up kind of to the brow bone. So the next thing I'm gonna do is eyeliner. Okay, so a nice kind of thick black line. So I'm gonna do um, my, dip, my brows with our Long Last Brows formula. And then do the natural line on top. I'm just gonna fill it a little bit. And then the front kind of do the brushing, the strokes where you brush up, like the way your hair naturally grows. And so I'm gonna do the same on the other side, brush underneath, fill it a little bit, and then brush with the natural strokes of my brows. Brows, ta-da! Next I'm going to just apply some blush. Okay, so sure it's blended on the bottom too. So we got blush on. Now I'm going to um, go in with the Cocoa Glow Bronzer. You know, when it gets like a little bit too dark for you, you can use a powder brush and just kind of blend it out to soften it up a little bit. Take it to go kind of add a little bit of contouring up in the hairline. Ooh, that's a sexy way. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you flip your hair when you do it. I love highlighter. It's my favorite. You put some, okay, I'm kind of crazy. Put it like down the bridge of your nose. Especially the tip. Put it, I like to sweep it across my cheeks so that like um, when I go at like any angles, the light hits it. Mm hmm Yeah, it looks nice. Do a little bit on my forehead, not too much, and then just use my fingertip and kind of go a little bit above the cupid's bow. Yay! So another thing I like to do, I'm sure you've anybody who's ever seen me talk about our mascara before. I like to curl, uh, bend my wand. It helps me um, collect more product onto the wand and it also helps to get the lashes. I feel like no one looks, looks pretty when they're in place. I know, we're always like fish face. <laughs> now I'm gonna use Nepal, our Cocoa Matte Butter Lipstick. And so, that, that's the look, right? Okay, we love you, bye. 
Thanks everyone for watching. Subscribe for more.